Hi everybody and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to go over just how you can fail your OSCP. That's right, who wants to pass? Who wants to do that? I've gone to all the great lengths to work out the best way to get all the information you need to fail this already insanely hard exam. So let's get into it. So first up, you don't want to read the whole PWK handbook. It's 700 pages. Who's got time for that? Let's just not read it. Next, there's about 70 machines in the PWK course. Who's got flip time for that? That's way too many. Just do a few of the easy ones like Alice and you should get a general picture on how to do it. So next, when you get stuck, don't worry about working it out yourself. Just head across to the offensive security forums and see how other people did it. Don't waste your time trying to work out how to do it yourself. Next up, we don't want to use any additional tools outside of what we learned in the PWK. Tools are for fools. We want to be leap and do everything with the command line. Except for Metasploit. When it comes to Metasploit, all you need to do is set rhost and lhost and you've got your shelf. This won't come back to haunt you at all during exam day. The night before your exam, make sure you spend as much time possible training. Don't bother about getting any sleep. You want to study as much as you can. Now before you go into the exam, be sure to read as many people's experiences about the exam as possible, like on Discord. It's not going to psych you out and it will just help you get into the best mindset as possible. Next up, you want to make sure you drink as much caffeine as possible. Caffeine is energy. So be sure to drink about maybe 8 cups of coffee an hour. Next, you want to be really rude to the proctor. They're invading your privacy. Don't even bother telling them when you go into the bathroom. Actually, better yet, don't go to the bathroom. Just have a bottle nearby. Because I want to spend all 24 hours on the computer because taking breaks is just a waste of time. Like, you need to spend every waking minute at, at, at the computer. So now we've finished the 24 hours and we're writing up our report. We might just have enough points to pass. So be sure to really don't pay much attention to your report. Have many spalling bad and grammar. And don't bother including too extensive write up on how you exploited the machines. Just a few screenshots of the roof flag. I mean, they made the machine. Why should you tell them how to exploit them? So don't worry too much about their strict requirements with the reporting. Just send it in a doc file. You don't need to worry about the 7-zip or anything like that. So if you follow this guide, in 10 business days, you will have successfully failed your OSCP. So congratulations, you failed your OSCP. Now what you need to do is learn how to pass this thing. So be sure to check out this video here.